How's it going, everyone? This is me, Thenic. I'm joined with Happy Meal tonight. We're uh, streaming for the Raving Mad Gamers semi-final number one between BZK and Happy Meal. Give me the honors. Hi, hi, hi. How are you doing? <laughs> I'm good, man. How's it going? Yeah, not bad, not bad. Yeah, we've got a, a great game on a great game on our hands. Nice. And uh, oh wait, I. Uh... The names of the of the lobby aren't the the team names. Uh, sh aren't I... the team names? Oh no uh, worries. Should, should we check? restart it real um, quick? I think it would be best. Let's let's quickly rerun it. Yeah, yeah. My bad. My bad. All good. Anyway, guys, let's. Uh, so it's uh, it's between PZK and Carfine Vidia tonight. It's the first semi final for the summer league of the. Uh, of the Raving Mad Gamers uh, Summer League that's been taking place or that started in February already. So <clears throat> this is going to be a good one, man. Um, I'm really psyched about this. I haven't seen Berserk play in quite some time. I've, I've watched Carfind Video play um, over the other weekend uh, with, the, with the land that they had. Sorry, just uh, one of the players just sent me a message here. All right, cool. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I watched Carfind Video playing over the uh, playing at the LAN uh, that happened in Joburg at the uh, New Metro uh, Gaming Center. I think that's what you call it, um, and it was off the hook. Like seriously, it was done really, really well. I was so excited being you know, just like by my TV and and watching this on you know uh, on stream. It was just like phenomenal. I don't know. Happy Meal. Did you did you see any of it? Um, I watched it over over the stream. Unfortunately, I couldn't be there, but I heard it was uh, it was pretty crazy, and there was some really cool rock league going on there. Yeah, I think that was yeah. a, a massive movement in the SA in the SA rock league community. To be honest, that was. No, I agree. Yeah, I I'm, agree. I'm, I was super keen when they announced it. Unfortunately, I couldn't go. But yeah, as a whole. I couldn't be there either. I mean, I'm based in Cape Town, so it was a uh, it was a bit of a, a trek indeed to get there. But uh, I know that that DF obviously he was in the the you know oh DF from, from I made amazing. another mistake. Oh my goodness, I'm so sorry. I spelled the team. What name. was the mistake you made? I made, I spelled the team names wrong. I spelled uh, Berserk wrong. Oh my goodness, this is this is <laughs> all good. Don't no, worry what? about it. So let's o leave one more time. R just make it BZK, man. I B think that's the easiest. B Everybody knows him as that. B-E-R-K. Berserk. B-E-R-Z-R-K. That's right. Yeah. Okay. So I'm pretty stoked to see what they've done to change their style of, of play uh, since that weekend. Because, I mean, it was a pretty pretty jam-packed weekend indeed, or day for that matter, of, of Rocket League at the uh, at the New Metro Gaming, Gaming Center. Um, now that I think back, I actually did watch a bzk match i can't remember who they played against uh, exactly but um they blew my mind as well i mean i haven't seen lazy but in in action since i actually played with him in literally one of the first rlx uh six mans that happened i i still remember it was me him and uh man Zebra, CPZ, that's the guy. Yeah, he, he. the three of us were in a team uh, playing against, I can't remember exactly who, Nianfu. You still remember Nianfu? Oh, yeah, were you Nianfu. part of the scene back then? Yeah? I, uh, I joined, like, just as he was getting off the scene. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah, that was, like, right yeah, way back in the beginning. Right in the beginning. And uh, it was, yeah, it was such a fun, fun thing, I remember. But uh, I'm logging in again. Are we set up? Are we ready to go? Yeah, I think... Uh... Cool. Can... I'm going to join Spectate right off the bat. Here we go. It seems like they're ready to jump in, man. Okay, so we've got Empty Promises, Mr. Low, and uh, is it Pornflex on the on the Carfine video side? Yep, indeed it is. And on and they're in the orange. And we've got Lion, Timmy, and Lazybutt in the blue for, for BZK. <clears throat> <laughs> Lazy, Lazy Bud's choices of cars always gets me, man. Like, I don't even know what that car's name is that he's yeah, playing with right I, now. I don't know. He tends to, uh, I don't know, break the mold when it comes to car choices. No, most definitely, man. Most definitely. So we've got Pornflex. Um, him and I, we played together a few times before as well. And I have to say that he is hes honestly one of the best readers of the ball in the game. 
Mikey. Oh, there we go. First first goal of the match. Lion coming through with a nice aerial goal there. Um, what I was saying about uh, Pornflex, it's just like he, the fact that he can read the ball so well, uh, even before the ball gets wherever it's going, it's it's phenomenal. And I, I really hope we can we can see that in tonight's game. But uh, as it stands now, 1-0 oh for... Uh, one north for BZK. Yeah, it's, I think it's gonna be a real close game. Um, these guys tend to be, you know, top competitors. They yeah. These are two really, really good teams. Yeah, man. I would um, say our, our top. Yeah, definitely in the top, top of our community. Yeah, most, most definitely. And I mean, uh, oh, there we go. You see what I mean? Like, he went up. I think even before the ball came came his way. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Paul Blake's, uh He's a good player. I don't know. Is Perfect. He, is he been around here for a while? I'm not sure. Pornflex has been since the beginning, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, he was part of uh, a previous previous team called Fortitude Black, and uh, they were a bunch of mates, if I don't, if I remember correctly. And uh, oof, lion, <laughs> man, oh man, this guy means business, bro. Check it out. I thought he was gonna dunk him, but then he just like popped it right over him. Insane. This guy, he always, he's literally been there since the beginning, I know, for, for sure. And uh, he seems like a really cool guy. I'd love to meet him one day. And um, his, just his control with the car is, is always fantastic. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm messing this up real bad here. Um, What's happening? I'm messing up the... Uh, okay, hold on. Give me a second. There you go. <laughs> Is the stream still running though? That's no, all I want. No, it's running, about. but I was I was accidentally <laughs> watching one player's perspective. I think I'm doing it again. I am. Oh my goodness! I'm so sorry. I've never done this before. It's all good. You can leave it on player's perspective, man. Like, no, no, no but it was uh, it was running to one player, not not all of them. Not all of them. Oh, I see. Okay, no worries. All good. <clears throat> Ooh, nice pinch down the back wall there of their own of their own side. Timmy's Timmy's got it in for the. Uh... Okay, there we go. I think I fixed. I'm, I'm apologies for all those watching the stream. I, uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm not great at this year. Thank goodness, Happy Wheel stepped in for tonight because uh, it was a very short notice that we that we could uh, actually stream this match, and uh, I literally just got my fiber set up and running today. So I'm I haven't done any streaming yet, and I'm I'm not even sure what to do and how to set up anything. So thank you so much for stepping up for that, man. I'm sure Raving Mad Gamers and Oralex really appreciates it, bro. Uh, yeah, no no problem. Uh... I just hope it's 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 watchable. It's the most important, because otherwise, yeah. Yeah, all good. Ooh, a bit of a double commit there. Leaves the net wide open at the back there. What's going to happen now? Empty promises. Oh, he nearly put it down right there for Mr. Lowe. Um, I don't know. Like Mr. Lowe, uh, with his with his title of uh, Grand Champ, really impressive, man. Like he kicked so much ass at the uh, at the LAN. It was next level what that guy pulled out of the hat. And uh, he's he hasn't been in the game as long as some of the other players on the field tonight. But he's definitely got the skill to make up for it, man. Like honestly, he blows my mind every time he gets close to the ball. He his his play style kind of reminds me of. Uh, of what uh, Justin and uh, of NRG is. Yeah, I mean, I, I think I think Mr. Lo I, 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 when I joined the scene, he was here, and he was he was always quite a big name, and that's that's kind of <clears throat> that's kind of how I've known it. But I, I have seen him going from like being a good player to a great player in quite a short amount of time, and that's yeah, that's always a good example of like efficient efficient working. Exactly, and I, I'm I'm pretty sure like because he was part of WSG and uh, uh, when he started out in the uh, uh, in the the kind of call it professional playing in South Africa, okay. and yeah, it seems like Carfind or uh, Video decided to to pick him up. Um, I know that there was another. Oof, um, Jesse, did you see that center pass right off the their side into the, into the no, just. Crazy redirect right into the center of the goal there. Fantastic. I think it was a bit of an unfortunate uh, a touch by Lion into the center, which. Uh, yeah, allowed, yeah, no, you're right. that, we'll have that goal. You're right. I'm, I misspoke. <clears throat> Ooh, nearly a center ball off the kickoff. There. What's empty going to do with that? Another double commit there. It's far. I find it funny. Is so. Uh, Sometimes communication gets the better of you. Oof, right off the crossbow, guys. Mr. Lowe, my man. 
can see that when I win this, I want to get into the final. The final is, is yet to be announced, the date of it, but the the second semi-final is happening on Thursday. And uh, we'll keep you up to date with that. Uh, follow us on Twitter if you if you get a chance. Um, Raving Mad Gamers and RLXSA. And uh, check us out, man. Anybody who's new to the scene that's watching right now, Mr. Lowe, I told you, man, he's ready for this. Check it out. Oh, good time, Papa. Having the Season 9 Grand Champ title there. I mean, he deserves it, bro. Like, honestly, he, he knows what he's doing with his car. And in all honesty, I, f I feel like there are more players in South Africa that deserve that title. And I'm going to get a lot of, um, you know, messages about that. I can tell you right now for just saying that. But I, I truly feel like we have players that are worth carrying that title and just have not broken through to it, unfortunately. But with three seconds on the clock, I think it's uh, safe to say that Carfine is going to have this one. I just want to go back. Yeah, I think there's oh, many, oh, many, quite a few players. I also agree that uh, deserve the GC, the GC title, but yeah, but uh, but don't have it. And yeah, I, I think like our our situation, our current situation, our, our like our, our the ping, the latency causes some issues. So it's I guess some. Some players yeah, are demotivated. Yeah, and so <clears throat> it is definitely an issue. I mean, and uh, you're never gonna you're never gonna find that title playing on South African servers. I mean, even just being on, let's say, for instance, a Diamond Three slash Champ level, it's it's very difficult to find games when you search. Um, and I'm not trying to be like, oh, you know, boasting, whatever. It's just like it, it is what it is. There's there's players that are lower lower tiers, and there are more of them than what there are of the people that stand out. And the people that stand out are the people that we're watching right now. That's why we can put them on stream. It's it's just it makes sense, don't you think? No, I, I agree. Yeah, I agree. And like, I think it's 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 our community is small, and you know, it, it's it's unfortunate to see uh, uh, that our player base. Oh, is, you know, oh, oh my word! That was too close. It would have been super unfortunate for BZK though, yeah, because would've... I saw that blue was uh, had a blue trail on it. I mean, the ball had a blue trail on it. So uh, Pawn Flag's getting clear there, but he's got no boost, unfortunately. Empty promises clearing it out for him. What's he going to do now? Oh, oh lazy, but just just missing it, Mister Low. You need to clear this out, boy. Let's get it through into the middle. Okay. So the thing about threes, man, you can you can do some risky plays and and you know if it does if it doesn't work out, you and your team knows what rotating is. Let's start off with that. You you kind of have a safe net to fall back on it. <laughs> As I say that, man, we get a nice little dunk from MT right into the goal. I mean, it was and it was an awkward ball for line. He just caught it and uh, just couldn't get any any rhythm going with that one. Yeah, I think he tried to control it and, and MT just took the opportunity to, to put it in. Exactly, he was on him, man. <clears throat> but I see, uh, I see Timmy's also rocking the, uh, the, what's his name? The Grand Champ title there and, uh, it brings me back, man. It brings me back to the, to the conversation. Oof. Great sense pass there, but lazy butts on it. Um, brings me back to the, the the thing that there are definitely more players I feel that that deserve the title, and um, hopefully, Ooh. nice one, Mr. Low. Hopefully, play. by next season we'll be able to see a few more because I know there was a few people that were on the brink of just reaching, um, you know, grand champ in the previous season. So let's let's see what happens. <clears throat> yeah, every season it seems to, to get the number of GCs in our community just gets bigger and bigger, which is great. Like, the improvement is awesome. Like our, our yeah. player base needs to mature, and uh, I'm keen. <laughs> well, I mean, mature wise, as in like you know, get we get better as players. We have more better players. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that definitely. That's what I mean. So we've got we've got the scores up. It's two 0 at the moment for a uh, Vidir. Might be three. Oh, just just miss. And uh, there we go, 3-0 for this game. It's the best out of seven that we're playing tonight, isn't it? Ah, uh, yes, it is, a, it is a best out of seven. All right, cool. That's Let a long series. Some... Plenty uh, plenty potential there. Plenty potential to, to make a comeback if you if you happen to go down. Yeah, if, you know? if you need one, of course, yeah, yeah. Exactly, yeah. But we're only in the second game now, so yeah, kind of no. getting ahead of myself there. <laughs> no, just saying, you know, it's, a, it's a long no, series. It's... And uh, yeah, drawn out Rocket League is good. Exactly, man. The more the more games there are, 
the the more I enjoy it, bro. Because uh, Rocket League is is constant fun, in my opinion. Mm, yeah. Except when you except when you have super high ping. <laughs> That's just my saltiness coming through. Sorry about that. All right. <clears throat> Timmy's got a may, might be waterfall. Yeah, there we go. Okay, but Pornflex read it off off the wall there. I don't think he has enough boost to do anything proper with this. Yeah, Timmy, Timmy read it. A DC or oh, RDC? I think RDC. Okay, I'm back in. There was a. <laughs> I was watching. I was on empty promises, and he just continued straight right past the ball for some reason. <clears throat> so I'm just. I've been told. I was gonna change. No, it's all good, man. Yeah, follow, follow. I see. There's a few messages coming through. No, you, yeah, my. Uh, there's no, just good notifications coming through, and I. Uh, Oof, I to really make there. sure it's it's gone. So That's hundred percent, man. You keep on doing your thing, bro. I'll try and keep the. Keep the words flowing. <laughs> oh, Ooh. nice little bump there from Timmy. Uh, that definitely did save that goal. I mean, uh, he was right there to pass it straight down into the middle, and uh, that would have definitely been a goal, another goal for them. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll fix the, the distance notifications after. Yeah, after. after this yeah, game I don't want to. I don't want to bring the menu up while we're playing. You know. Yeah. Okay. 100%. Anyway, sorry about that. Oof. Logan, to get that. Yeah, he just got it into the corner there. On. Some something with my connection, it died. Yeah. I'm... Wait, so you, are you not in the game? No, I'm here. I'm here, uh... and I'm I'm here, and I'm gone. I'm here, and I'm gone. It's weird. Uh, it comes. Okay, okay, okay. Well, no, no, sorry. Okay, well, he's about to get the ball at the moment. So Ooh. sometimes, guys, when I say something, uh, oh, oof, I go by. Fine, you got it in, man. <laughs> if I say something and it's not what's happening on screen, please excuse because uh, what I see is uh, what I see. You know, so. Oh, okay, I was in the way. Right. Cool. <clears throat> oh, just sneaked up there. You know, that's a, that's for, in my personal opinion, that is always a risky move to to cheat up onto a, a face off like that. But I guess if you don't have enough time left in a game, it's a, a risky move worthy of taking. That went nearly went in, but it turned out to be a great pass. Lazy but passing it over to the left there. Who's there to get it? Promises. Just oh, intercepting that goal, giving a nice center. Line is you're gonna drop it down to Timmy. Timmy will bring it back into the backboard. Oh, okay, Mr. Low reading it properly there. <clears throat> oh my word, that nearly went in with a banger of a shot. Timmy, he sees line. Line's gonna put it in. Wow, that's a close one. Nearly there. Lazy word. He ran out of boost. I think if he had like at least 10 more boosts for that one, it would have properly went into goal there but uh, unfortunately for bzk this one's this one's not going through for them the way that they planned they might get a last oh no <laughs> empty promises says nope we stop it right now well done vidir what is the score that we've got now is it uh two mm, yeah it's currently two nil a two nil series lead yeah cool Oh, I'm saying okay. So, one thing that has like been really interesting for me this season coming into South African Rocket League is the just uh, the fact that you get these sponsorships for teams that are really quite amazing. Honestly, I mean, you see, you see, Vidya being sponsored by Carfind and. That is, a, it's an amazing achievement being able to put that in your name, a, a big company like Carfind, um, and you get uh, like there's another team the other day that I saw. It's, it's blanking on my name on, in my brain now, but I can't remember. It, I that, know, uh, that also got a recent really big um, oh, recently, sponsorship. Uh, I don't know about recently. I just know that like uh, sponsorships for Rocket League, especially not just esports, but like just specific Rocket League, is getting bigger, which is uh, which is great. And... Yeah, dude, it's definitely great. I mean, Rocket League is only in its, I think, fourth year now, and as a as an esport, and the the 
sizes of the lands and the prize monies and the prize pools and everything. It's just like, it's nuts, bro. It's In it's. Like internationally, I agree, it's great, but uh, South Africa and esports has always been a bit of a. It's always been a struggle, man. Yeah, but I, it has. In 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 my opinion, like, you know, I'm a yeah, I'm an OG man. I come <laughs> I come from back in the day, but so I'm obviously like you see a lot of you see a lot of improvement then from what it was. I've so. seen an immense amount of improvement over the years. Um, coming from like Counter Strike 1.6 days, and uh, you know, back when when we played Dota when it was oh line just putting it underneath the crossbar really really good read there from him from the bounce um from when Do when dota was still played on the warcraft 3 mod it was you know we, we, it's how it evolved into what it is now with rocket league being so new to the or to the to the esports scene the amount that has grown just tells me the potential that this game has for the future um in in esports you know so i'm i'm definitely keeping an eye on this and i've uh rlcs season nine has or oh, season seven just started this this past weekend and i've only been able to watch a bit of it but as as it stands it looks to be one of probably the best seasons coming coming this uh you know to this game yeah so well, I'm, I'm truly looking forward to it rlcs tends to do that it just gets better every year yeah yeah it's always good stuff and yeah, I'm, I'm keen. Wanna see what's happening, yeah. Can miss mm -hmm. the ball. Lots of space. Oh, uh, miss from the slow there. Yeah, Pawn Flex, he comes up with this weirdest flips off the walls, man. Sometimes, like, the few games that I've played with him and I randomly punt the ball forwards he would just like randomly jump off out of nowhere and direct that ball straight to goal sometimes really good sometimes not as great but i mean the fact that he's there tells he's, me what yeah. mechanical skill he has you know going for the ball yeah. no it's great i've noticed uh, uh, uh timmy and uh, and lion find each other all the time in this game it's in, especially the, the, in the last three like two games they've been finding each other a lot good passing <laughs> some of them it hasn't shown the, the scores oh sorry sorry no, no, that's that is true. You know the way that I have it. Um, I might be wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong here, anybody. Um, but as far as I know, Timmy and Lion uh, actually come a long way back already. Oh, oh open net, wide open net. What yeah, happened yeah. there, guys? Rotation see, yeah. getting a better of you. I mean, no, confident. It's looking <laughs> looking a little complacent from uh, from Vadir's behalf. I think they're they've relaxed a little bit. They're they're two goal, they're two games ahead. That's and, the thing, yeah, yeah, I think so as well, and uh, this is really the time for, for BZK to take advantage of that, definitely, because if they don't do something now, I would I would say if they don't win this game, this coming game right, that we're yeah. busy with now, it's going to be a bit of a struggle, because uh, yeah, it is only a best of seven, right? No, it is a best of seven, yes, that's correct. It's not a best of ten, so yeah. <laughs> not that I've ever seen a best of ten, no, but yeah. I'm just kidding. <clears throat> Timmy, is that going to be enough? Oh, my oh, word, that was too close, too close. Double tap. tap. So what I was saying was about Lion and Timmy, and um, as far as I know, they are actually good friends and have been playing together for a very, very long time. Um, oh. I remember when, when Magoo, Timmy, and uh, I think it was Grinch or someone, um, Grinchmeister was part of uh, Red Neptune back in the day. Well, just as well. just as the... As the uh, well, yo, my, I'm lost for words, yeah. Um, just as Rocket League started in South Africa to become quite big, um, I remember people telling me that Lion and Timmy were, were playing together quite a bit. So the fact that they're, oh, Pawn Flags, just patiently placing it in the top left corner there. Um, the fact that they, that they have this um, synergy going comes from playing together for such a long time. I mean, it's been three years. So... You were definitely right in seeing that. Yeah, they do find each other a lot. Yeah. No, mm. no, if that's the case, if they're good friends, that makes a lot of sense. Yeah. No, oh, definitely. Yeah, Lions. Oh, look low. He's going to redirect oh, that. Oh. <laughs> Lion saw that coming and he saved it properly. To me, nearly. Oh, my word. Something I've uh, I've identified is uh, Vadir love to play on the on the backboard. They're very good at it, very quick at it, and they get their passes straight off and into the center as, as quick as possible. They no, you are hundred percent correct, and uh, the, it shows. You know, it shows in in how I would say the the amount of pressure that they put on 
on VZK is all from that backboard position. Yeah, it's... I think like they all have this mindset of the the ninety percent pass and not the ten percent goal. And they'll just give it again and again until eventually it gets it goes in the back of the net. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah, yeah, that's that's true. Um, and it just goes to show how the uh, how the game has evolved since since the start of it when when everybody thought, okay, cool, well. You know, let's be a let's be a three-man team, but play a one v one game. So it's you know, yeah, or one v three game for that matter. It's it's really turned into a, a passing game, um, especially when the the guys that stand out at the moment. That is definitely the meta. Um, but I don't see it going back to anything. Uh, how, how can I say a single player related? Oh, like back, so, to, back to what what it started with. No, it, I don't think. Uh... That would just be, I think, uh, uh, evolution in the in the wrong direction. In the wrong way, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. It just this this kind of passing play is is what makes the game better. It makes it, you know, I would say more interesting to watch, and it's just it's uh, it, it the play gets better just in general overall with the, when you involve yeah. everyone instead of just yourself. So I don't think uh, it'll ever go back to what it was. It can't. Uh, Rock League's gone too far in one direction to to stop and change. I think. Yeah. Exactly. Well, exactly. the right direction. Don't get me wrong, please. I I. I definitely agree that this is the right direction. No, I agree as well. Um, and what I wanted to add onto that, um, the fact that the the passing players have become, or the evolution that it's that that's been taking place over the years, is I have no idea what might what might happen in the future. Like, what mechanics will come to light, and how they would incorporate different styles of play. It's just it's phenomenal. Like you, you watch guys like like these guys on our screens at the moment, and just how they have put together some of the plays of tonight already. You know, it's just it's it's fantastic. And not not just that. I, th I think back onto onto the land the other day. Um, by the way, congrats to XD for for winning that land. Um, I know that they are not. Uh, in the, they're not playing in one of these semi-finals but still they they took the the champ yeah um, they took the number one they took the, the w land. yeah the w for the for the land which was pretty cool i mean it was a fantastically good and well organized land and uh, as well as what this uh this summer summer league is and i'm um, for me I'm, I'm fortunate to be to be here tonight I'm, I'm i haven't been following anything at all so i've just did a bit of a catch up and it seems to be very interesting all the teams that have been qualified and, and uh, I'm looking forward to what the finals can hold because the, the next semi final seems to be quite uh, interesting teams as well I mean we've got who do we have we've got salvage proficiency and um Vassarus esport yeah yeah um yeah the the league I think the top uh, the results the top 3 teams have uh, so close uh, the, the the difference in points is so close due to the, the, what's happened. Both all both the, all three top teams, also the first three top three teams, both have all their games won except once. They all have one loss. And uh, all right, yeah. Okay. So um, it's Lazy it's, it's <laughs> the patience, yeah. Oh, sorry, yeah. No, I'm just saying it's a it's a real close uh, league. The the summer the, the RMG summer league. It's 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 real nice and close competitive because yeah. <clears throat> I, it I don't seems know. to be very yeah. close, man. Yeah, I've never seen. I've never seen that where the top three teams have, you know, the same. Uh, yeah, games same stats at the end of it all. Yeah, lost. yeah, it's crazy. That's true. Um, just to just to f sorry, man. Yeah, continue. You were no, still saying something. No, I was just saying also. Um, just to show that those three top those top teams also have the top players in the in the play statistics, like the the play right. stats. Yeah, the the majority of those uh, of those players are held in the in the top four teams. Which, yeah, exactly. Which makes sense. Yeah. Which makes sense, obviously. But yeah. Yeah, that, that's that's true. But that's actually what I what I wanted to bring up just now. Um, I've got the stats here next to me, and it says here that uh, t the top match score is from Timmy, um, who's doing exactly what I just was explaining now. My word, empty water pass straight into for Mr. Low. That was insane. It seems um, uh, the game speed's definitely picked up. Yeah. This is this has turned into something hot now. It's it's turned into something where I need to where I think we need to start concentrating on some play by play <laughs> stuff because yeah, it's no. just like seriously heating up right now. If you can get a pass into the middle with this one, he's got a few little bit of boost left. Oh, oh great pass! Um, easy. Yeah, but he's going to back pass it to Lion. Yeah, he saw that coming. Lion probably warned him that there was a guy on him, and uh, backward pass straight. But the empty great promises is there. But 
lazy butt. If uh, if you were just a bit more hasty, that ball would have went straight past you. <clears throat> Timmy's got 24 boosts, not enough. He's picking up some welfare pads there. There's a few demos coming out this round. Um, I, th I feel like they're getting a lot more aggressive this round. And uh, like I said, that you know that uh, that demo that took place. Definitely mess with their rotations because you can see Elizabeth's like completely out of it for that for that tiny brief moment and Pornflex just started. Okay, you know what? Seeing as that happened, now we've got to capitalize and uh, bring it back to one one. Yeah, I really do hope uh, that. Uh, I don't know. Oh, who, who are you voting for? Before I uh, mention anything, you got any? Uh, oh, not no, voting I, for. Yeah. Well, I, yeah. I, I, I'm not voting for anyone, bro. This is this. <laughs> that would be that would be wrong of me to do that and and. Oh, yeah, cast I this we, thing. we we can't we can't we can't vote for uh, <laughs> for teams while we're casting. My bad. Uh, okay. Exactly. What, what what are your what are your what are your your predictions? That's a better question. My bad. That's yeah. a better question. I, I, I uh, like predictions. That one. I'm sorry. Is he gonna put it in? No, lazy but saw oh, that coming in. Oh, I'm a That's a goal. Nice. Uh, in well, you know what? We should have done this before the match. That would have been a better, a better oh. guess than that. But uh, for at, for the moment, I have to go with uh, with Vidya. It just seems like they they more tighten it. It seems like they get their passes correctly, and um, it's just when there's when when the ball is floating just randomly somewhere, the first person to pick it up That's in Vidya. most cases okay. is a is a Vidya player. You know, okay. so I feel like they have more ball position in general, and. Uh, yeah, that's 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 my that's my opinion from what I've seen so far. It's not that geez, you see that it's <laughs> like demo after demo. Um, it's not that BZK is not not kicking butt at all. I'm just I'm just saying, I'm thinking. That, you're, you're uh, just saying uh, video just seems to be a bit more on point, you know. It seems faster, like they've got a bit more their clinical. Ducks a little bit more yeah, in a row. Okay. Yeah, you know what I mean. No, I can agree. I think the, that uh, video putting a slightly more pressure now it's actually quite a bit more pressure than Berserker right now and I don't think that's something that they can't change uh, and mm. I'm hoping hoping Berserker can get back into this because it'll be a, a, cl a close competitive Rocket League is, is always what I want to watch you know no one likes to watch uh, 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 you know Rocket League that's a awesome. whitewash yeah type exactly, of thing. Yeah, so, no, exactly. So I'm, I'm no, hoping I... I'm hoping I'm really hoping BZK will bring this back as well man yeah. like I, I, honestly I also want to see proper constant rocket league in front of my eyes it's uh, <laughs> sometimes i yeah, dream about yeah, it's, it's, awesome, it's yeah. just like i'm so fanatic about it it's insane so um these these two teams are definitely bringing their a game tonight um i feel like bzk is struggling a little bit like i said with uh, with getting control of the ball um and keeping it keep keeping possession of it but they've got this is now the third the third match of the of the series right Yes, there's been. Well, yeah, I'm. I'm not keeping track of this, man. Oh. Okay, so that's, that's uh, that's game three to Vidya. Is it? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. So it was, uh, I was correct. This was game three. <laughs> my bad, man. Oh yeah, sorry, my bad. I was uh, concentrating on the the end there. Yeah, this is this is game three to Vidya. All good. <clears throat> it's gonna ready it up there. Now you see, no, we were wrong. It's the that was the fourth game, it's three one. Now I thought, I thought BZK no, no. took. Oh wait, yeah, no, but yeah, they 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 did. No, no, BZK yeah. took the first one. Yeah, right, you're right. My bad, my bad. They took the. No, they took that. Okay. So, so it's three one, right? Yep, three one. Yeah, three one. For okay. Vidya. Three one to Vidya. So this might be the last game of the night, man. Yeah, so it's first of four. Okay, cool. So it's three one. Yeah, let's uh, let's hope BZK can bring it back. I'm sure I they really can. do I, hope I, so. I, 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 I'm, I don't hope. I know they can. They, they've got in them. They've I feel like them. I feel like um, I feel like Vidya wants to play more. They they've got this style of playing where they it's just they kind of don't ever want the the ball to touch the ground at all, and uh, that just tells me how hungry they are for this game. And literally, as I say that, Pornflex just like slams it right into the goal, even though there was a defender. <laughs> Timmy was just like out of it for a second, unfortunately. Yeah, it was a it was a bit of a weak clear there, and it just yeah, and, and uh, easy 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 pots on goals. That was pretty even fifty. I mean, kick off. <laughs> Oh, again, line looking, line looking for Timmy. For Timmy, yeah. yeah. But Timmy, Timmy's always, uh, always been one of those guys that that can redirect the ball fantastically oh, well towards the net. 
overall, Timmy is a great player, and I think yeah. uh, like passing to him uh, would do your team justice. Oh, nice. what a great bump, bump lion! Oh, that was that, that was, was a brilliant. good good play. Uh, if they can come up with more stuff like that for for the I rest think, of the, I think they've got it. Yeah, and that, that'll definitely boost the team's morale. I mean, that is that, that's excitement right there. Yeah, I mean, usually when I play as well, and something like that happens, like it, you just get this. It's a bit, it's a bit toxic, but you feel so good, man. No, of course it's you like feel good. I mean, you scored a goal and it looked good. Oh, why, why exactly. Not? Yeah. No, that's that's a good start. That's uh, that's something keep coming. We got a one. We got a level playing ground at the moment, though. But uh, in, I always see it as a. It's not a one-one. It's back to normal. You know what I mean? So. Yeah, they're still Lion, fighting. Yeah, they're fighting for the lead. So. Yes, exactly. So let's see what's going to happen, man. As we've got just over three three minutes and fifty seconds left. For either match point or we're going to a three-two, three-two match. Let's see what happens, man. It's. Uh, it's nail biting right time right now because this is this this could mean the end of the end of the night for yeah if you're a berserk fan you're sitting on the edge of your seat you're sitting on the edge of yeah. your seat exactly <clears throat> Timmy with a great clear out of his half towards lazy but lazy but unfortunately couldn't capitalize on that lane might bring it up for the backboard Mr Lowe just misses it that would break it and bring it down for empty promises but he brings it with this weird kind of pinch over to the other side again. <clears throat> Timmy nice just ball. off target, unfortunately. Couldn't get proper control on that. Line bringing it into the middle, but there's no one there. Empty promises, like, it doesn't even have to intercept. It's just a plain oh, pass to him. That's a, <sighs> again, off the backboard. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. again. Guess, You're right, man. Yeah, no, they really do, uh, do enjoy that backboard. I'm, I'm not saying it's a bad play, but they, they utilize it well they capitalize off the no, geez, man. Yeah. in my opinion that's like the way to go bro it's uh passing players and backboards but the backboard is supposed to be a pass so you know that's that's just how it goes i feel if you if you don't score the goal if you score the goal without having it being a pass it's not a worthy goal <laughs> in my opinion <laughs> yes that, that, but, that's, if uh, you, that works but if you but if you win the game that way you? i mean yeah it's, it's what it is yeah, I agree with you. Like, it's a, a, a nice goal is definitely when the team's involved rather than just you know one person. Yeah, or running the or at some random pinch from the other yeah, side straight into your goal. Yes, I want to lose it when that happens, bro. <laughs> yeah, that's no, no one likes that. I mean, uh, it doesn't happen. Oh, 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 what, what a, a hit! Lion saving that ball. That was insane. I think that's just plain experience coming through there, man. A little bit of a double commit to me, hitting it with the back of his car. Honestly, that that was a bit lucky. I'm yeah, not gonna I mean, lie. I think it surprised everyone, and that's why there was no goal there. Mm. Nice one, line. Look at that back back post um, rotation, man. If if he didn't rotate the way that he should, then that would have been a goal. And, and big ups to line for that. He's he's always been on top of rotating, and he's a really really solid player. I guess that's why he's here. You know. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> there you go. Well, I see a berserk. I don't know. They're, they're panicking a little bit. They're they're not thinking about their clears as much as they should be. I don't know. Right? Yeah, that, that, that clear from line wasn't wasn't great. Uh, I know he's under, he's obviously again, under some pressure. Yeah. yeah again, yeah, it's just they're not. It's it's it feels like they're not communicating properly in in the sense of that they're not telling each other where the other players on the on the field are. Um, it's kind of like they they, but they, I guess that's how some teams are. Some teams can speak a lot, and some other teams just see what's going on and and. And that might be to their detriment, you know? So, I don't know what's going on in their comms. It might be interesting to just tune in there, but we can't do that. No, obviously <laughs> not, yeah. Um, I think yeah. another problem is their possession. They don't keep much of it, uh, which I think uh, is probably one of the most important. For this, these high level plays where tech, like mechanics don't really play a big role because everyone's kind of on the same playing field. But yeah. it's the small things, rotation, you know, communication, and, and yeah, what to do with the ball, that, and, and keeping possession. I don't think Berserk are doing nearly as well as Vidya, which, uh, that, which is... That's where the, the, the teamwork comes in, like you say. It's, it can be small mechanical things, yeah. It, it's all level here. Um, no one's better than the than the other. It's about how the team works together. And uh, clearly Vidya is doing a very good job at that at the moment. And, and like you said, with... Um, with BZK struggling to get those clears out uh, the way that they should be doing, and unfortunately, Lazy Bat just missed that. It could have been a perfect center for for Timmy that was that was there in the middle. We're coming up to the last 10 seconds of the game. Berserk uh, going to pull through now. Oh, if you didn't get that double touch, it would have been gone in. 
Line, no. Put the ball up. Oh. Can we get it in? It seems like Vidir is ah. taking this one. Well done, car find Vidir for taking the semi-final, man. This is, uh, that's it? Is that yeah. it? Yeah, yeah I that's think it. Uh, <laughs> that's about it, yeah. GG's, guys. Well played. And uh, it's honestly, it, it went by much faster than I anticipated. And it's unfortunate for, for BZK. And uh, I think we discussed why it is they, they didn't make it through um, the way that they wanted to. So it's, it goes to show teamwork is the way to go, man. Yeah, I uh, I agree. I agree. Like it, it, the, these, I would say that okay, the teams on top of this uh, of this this league are okay, so in first place is is Salvage Proficiency, second is uh, is is Carpan and and I believe third is Berserk. Um, and like it's it's weird that there's like a triangle, like a like a triangle going through there, and uh, so Vidya SP beat Vidya, Vidya beat Berserk, but Berserk beat. Uh, SP, it's it's uh it's interesting and uh, like when I don't know what happens after this um in terms of uh, who plays Berserk and w what what they do I don't know if they're knocked out if they are then obviously no one plays but it's just uh, it's interesting yeah, yeah. It's, it's I'm around. not too sure either I don't know if there's some sort of losers bracket thing happening um but I know that the next the next match is on Thursday evening and that would uh, I think I've mentioned it before um would be between salvage proficiency and and v yeah vice I, think, I think that's correct yeah okay anyway, um, I, think, I think yeah i just i just wanted to squeeze in the last thank you to raving mad gamers for for being able to host this 20 and, and bringing a fresh new vibe into the rocket league scene in south africa and i'm really excited about this i can't wait to to be to see what what the next um some uh, league might bring you know yeah, I'm, I'm really excited. I think that's they're making big movements in in the community. Again, I said that earlier, and yeah. uh, I just would like to uh, just yeah say thanks to myself. Thanks for the players and the watchers <laughs> out there. And uh, apologies for spelling the names wrong and uh, some some Man, players in the stream. Man, it's side. all good, bro. Is this your first time doing the stream thing? Yeah, yeah. This is my first time. Well, it, yeah. well, freaking done, man. Thank not, you. Not hey, bad at all. Uh, thanks for coming on, Carsey. Mm. Yeah, definitely. I I mean, any time, bro. And uh, and also thanks to RLX for helping with the arrangement of who who was doing the casting and who was doing the uh you know everything and and the stats that we put together for all of this and uh once again well done to the teams unfortunately bzk you you fell down on your knees begging for one last game but it just didn't work so uh well done to car find video and uh we hope to see you guys again soon thanks so much i'm scenic and uh happy meal on the stream thanks so much man yeah cheers guys thanks yeah. so. see you guys next time